Hey, hey, hey. What's up? <laughs> What's up, everybody? Happy Wednesday. We'll wait just a second for people to get on. Lola, come here, baby. Come here, girlfriend. Want a treat? Hope everyone's having a great week. Here. It's already Wednesday. Can't believe it. Yep, there's our other baby. Yeah, yeah. So, if you Darren. guys... Darren! Yeah! If you guys haven't guessed, we told you we would have uh, some guest appearances tonight. And uh, you're looking at one of them. Look at him. He's crazy. <laughs> Lola, come here. Come say hi. Hey, come here. Come here. We need to get you a new frisbee. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Yes. Yep. There's our other one. <laughs> All right. Spider bat. Here. I'll take I'll it. Get them <laughs> 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 Not so much, Darren. So, the uh, topic for tonight is what is your favorite pet? We're going to talk dog breeds. We don't have real babies, but we have... These are our babies, though. We have these guys. They're little black and white fur babies. So, Rock's a Boston Terrier. And Lola is a Border Collie. She's smarter than most five-year-olds. Really. She's super smart. <laughs> <laughs> it's crazy how smart she is. So, we would love to hear... Um, we're just going to tell you a little bit about how... This is an easy one tonight. We're just introducing you to our... Yeah. Our little little fam. Our littles. How, yes. Uh, Rocky is like a little vampire bat. Yeah, he's he can be crazy at times. He's, he's kind of like a grouchy old man. Um, he will be five in January, so he's but I mean look at the face. Like Thank you, Dolores. Yeah, Rocky's uh honestly he sleeps about twenty three hours a day and the uh, other hour he's He's trying to find food. He's crazy. He's he's like all over the place. And then Lola, our border collie, she's what, three now? Yeah, she'll be three in November. Let him down. <laughs> He's like, this is boring, Mom. <laughs> He's out. We're done. So, um, the border collie's crazy smart. She's awesome. She's, uh, so they're both driven by different things. Rocky is driven by food. You, you stick He's a, like me. <laughs> you stick a treat in that bad boy in his face. He will do anything you want. Lola, on the other hand, she doesn't care about treats. She cares about, like, toys. Yeah. like And having a job to do. What are we going to do? What are we going to do? You want to play ball? You want to play ball? Play ball for 24 hours. So it's crazy. What kind of, uh, what are your guys', I don't know, dogs, favorite pets? I am trying to talk Michael into getting another Okay, I'm the crazy dog lady. I will totally admit it. Like, if we go anywhere and there is a dog, whatever, it doesn't matter. I am all about that life. So, I keep trying to talk him into getting another dog. And it's technically not fair because I got to pick Rocky, the Boston Terrier, and then Lola was the runt of the litter. So, she's obviously a mama's girl. So, um... It's technically his turn, so. No more dogs. Um, not for a while. <laughs> we'll probably have kids before we have another dog, and that's still a long ways away, so. <laughs> yeah. Um, let's see. Linda, Border Collies are good. Gold mixes, I've heard. Yeah, I've, I've never heard anything bad about anything I had a golden, golden retriever growing up, and I loved her. We're going to try something. Whoa. Nope, that didn't work. That's kind of weird. Let's just stick with the, let's stick with <laughs> the original plan. Trying to do fancy plan. camera skills. So that's all we wanted to talk tonight is dogs. Dogs and pets. Our life. So, we're not going to mu have much tonight. So, q and is awesome. <laughs> you guys got any questions for the Weavers? Um, we're... Uh, I would not recommend a border collie. That's our border collie. If you're That's not um, somebody who's kind of active. So we had to come outside because they are 
Um, she likes to be outside. A Female lot. black doll, black lab. Darren, I'd have to agree with you. I love labs. Um, I like. I'm a chocolate fan myself, but uh, I do love some labs. English bully and a Yorkie. Those are cute. I think I would definitely love. I love. So I had a pug before we had Rocky. Um, I had a pug growing up. So I love smushy face dogs. So I would. I would probably definitely be down. Yorkies. I mean, I could tote them around. I'm totally about that life too. Hi. Yep, she decided to join us. So she's a mama's girl for sure. Yeah. So like, it's crazy the different personalities. Like Rocky, like sleeps all the time, eats. That's about it. Um, but he's the cutest dog. <laughs> <laughs> cutest he's being dog. Partial. Lola's no, he's super cute. And Lola <laughs> is like the she's sweetest dog. She's the sweetest dog I've I've ever come across <laughs> ever. Like literally, all she wants to do is love on you. Like what she's doing with Courtney right now. I know you guys can't see that, but. She yeah, loves me. She does love you. I'm her favorite. It's crazy. We got we got pretty lug with our pretty lucky with our dogs, honestly. I hope our kids turn out as good. They will. <laughs> <laughs> if they're anything like me, we're in trouble. Pugs, yeah. I love pugs. Courtney the loves The only pugs. problem with pugs, um, mine didn't live very long. He only lived to be like he was almost eight. Um, and they shed so bad. Like their hair. Granted, we are both covered in hair right now, but pugs have like two coats, I think, of like fur going on, so they should so bad, but they're so adorable. Yeah, your grand puppies. Hey, Michelle. <laughs> yeah, that's that's the norm, though, Lori. That's yeah, the norm. Lori, it's okay. It doesn't matter. I will take the kisses over the makeup any day of the week. Totally okay with that. How do you guys like the new scenery? You like the outdoor effect? You like the inside? I don't know. What are you guys saying? Yorkie name. Thanks, Lori. I feel like I'm a, okay. So this is completely off topic for all of the guys that are on there. But so these top knots are are kind of like the um, all the cool kids are wearing them, and I feel like I'm just a skosh too old to be pulling off the pebbles look. Um, so thanks for the the vote of confidence on the makeup. I'm hoping it distracts from me being too old outside cool okay we'll do it till it gets cold yeah and then we gotta go back inside and it's still actually a little hot for me it is a little warm out here quite September. frankly i'm ready who else is ready for fall oh i'm gosh. like super stoked for fall i'm not really super Thanks, excited Rachel. about uh winter time though to be honest with you but uh yeah so that's all we had for you guys tonight we wanted to introduce you to our babies you met rocky you met lola they're both kind of crazy, but yeah, that was it. it very it. casual tonight. Super we missed easy. last week because we um, we've both been kind of battling a little bit of nastiness, yeah. sickness. So um, yeah, sorry, sorry about that, uh, guys. Sixty-five degrees next week. I'm excited. Sixty-five will be nice. Sixty-five will be nice. Um, and speaking of next week, uh, we may not be able to yeah. do Weaver Wednesday, so. Stay Keep tuned. We'll let you know. Um, may have some things come up. But uh, if you guys have anything that you want us to ramble on about on Wednesdays, let us know. Yeah. Um, Lori, we're both feeling a lot better. Thank you. Um, but in the meantime, we'll, we'll think of some good ideas. Don't worry. You've though. met the babies. Don't worry. So we wanted you guys to introduce you guys. And we'll talk to anything. We'll talk anything but politics, okay? <laughs> yeah, no politics. No politics, because no, no one really likes politics. And religion, yeah, that's kind of off the table too. But other than that, we're good. We'll, we'll talk. You guys want to have, like what we have to say about that stuff anyway, so that's why we don't want to talk about it. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, who yes. likes to talk about Nobody likes talking no about No one likes talking about that stuff. Um, but yeah, so. Sports. Okay. Sports are cool. We can, we can do that for sure. We can, we love, we're both sports nuts, so. Yeah, my dad was actually a football coach um, for many, 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 many years. So I will talk sports all day long. Yeah. I'm totally okay with that. Totally okay with that. Absolutely. That's a good idea, Chris. It's a good one. That's a good one. And now my brother's actually a football coach. And they, unfortunately, he coaches for Oak Grove and they play Pleasant Hill on Friday night. So don't say anything bad about Marcus Brinkley because he's adorable. So that's all I have to say. Football. We, we can talk football for sure. 
Absolutely. We can talk real football. We can talk fantasy football. We talk it all. Talk all football. She grew up in a football household, so that's easy talk for her. I don't want to talk fantasy, though. <laughs> <laughs> so, all right, guys. Lawyer, Thank you. Panther. I love it. Thank you for tuning in. <sighs> um... I don't even know who the Chiefs play. That's on a great Sunday. question. They play the New York Jets. I am a diehard Chiefs fan, but the Jets have some serious weapons going up against our uh, secondary. So we got Brandon Marshall. We have who? Eric Decker. We have some guy's name I can't pronounce. And we have maybe one of the smartest quarterbacks in the league with Fitzpatrick. Right? No. Fitzgerald? I don't know. Ryan Fitzpatrick, I think. Yeah. I don't know anything about the Jets. Yeah. Ryan Fitzpatrick. I'm out. That's right. Um, you should probably do your research for you. It's Ryan Fitzpatrick. <laughs> I, get, I get him and Fitzgerald messed up because I of, think we should definitely do a what is it like to work with your spouse Q&A. We can do that too. I feel like that's that needs to be addressed. Either way. I think the Chiefs will win, <laughs> but I think it's going to be a shootout. This is my two cents, though. All right, guys. Thanks for tuning in. It's getting a little dark out, so can't stay out much longer. And her babies are falling asleep. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, she's real funny, Lori. <laughs> Agger on. <laughs> um, as long as you're laughing at your own jokes, that's all that matters, right? <laughs> all right. Thank you, guys. Yeah, absolutely. I'm glad you got to meet her babies. Um, if you have any recommendations of what this crazy dog lady should try to talk her husband into, I will welcome them. We, uh, we appreciate you all. Tune in, uh, obviously, for Sunday. Sunday Smart, 7 o'clock. I'll get it in right before the primetime game, Sunday Night Football. So uh, thank you guys. Have a great rest of the week. Make it awesome. <laughs> See ya. Bye.